Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, I hope everyone's doing great on this Saturday afternoon. We are in beautiful Muskoka, Lake Joseph. Uh, at my brother's cottage. It's going to be a great weekend. We are heading to Bracebridge, Ontario. Uh, it's a fire and ice festival. Should be a great freaking time. We'll see how it is. And if you want these kind of dreams, it's Californication It's the edge of the world in all of Western civilization The sun may rise in the east, at least it's... Everyone wants to do, I'm good. Okay, so currently Krabby Joe's is closed and we are trying to decide where we're going to go to lunch. People in our car want to go to Hong Kong buffet because, you know, Asian food is delicious. But Krabby Joe's... That would have been the number one, but it's closed, which sucks. What's so uh, now we're talking about going to Harvey's or McDonald's or some, you know, fast food restaurant. But we'll see what happens. And starving. Do I just go to Hong Kong? Buffet? Okay. So <laughs> and starving. I don't think. I'm Honestly, you guys would love the Hong Kong buffet. I, I want to go to uh, Hong Kong buffet. They have like starving. Spring, all the appetizers, like the spring rolls, egg rolls, all that oh, stuff. Their sushi is Then they've decent. got the sushi. Starving. Then all you can eat sushi. Then they've got the sweet and sour chicken. Do I just chicken. pretend that we get lost? All the lo mein, <laughs> all the Chinese dishes. <gasps> lo mein. So, your freaking thing just cut. No, 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 I'm fine. I just we were off, there man. like a month ago. There. Oh, there we go. Tire I was pressure. kicking in the wrong place. Huh? The tire pressure warning came Okay, so for anyone who owns an yeah. F-150, if your heat goes out, do you have to solve it by kicking it? Is that what? Is that how Under you fix it? Under the glove box. Under the glove box. I just want to know: is any Ford F-150 owners, if your heat goes out, is that what you do? Okay, change of plans. We are at Simply Cottage, uh, which is a shopping spot for cottage stuff, and we'll see what's up in there. read that right 130 bucks for a stuffed skunk animal are you serious so this was a really cool piece of art that was crafted by an artist in muskoka and it was made out of wood metal saw blades if you take a really close look you can see just all the levels of detail that was put into this piece of art it's very cottagey and uh, it's a really, really unique piece of art.
Thanks so much guys for watching and taking the time to uh, watch my weekly vlog. Um, hit the like button, subscribe, and uh, hopefully we'll see you next time.